Well, it was tough to see the Jazz 9 game winning streak come to an end on Friday night against the Clippers, but they say it may have been a good thing. Help keep them grounded and focused. They took on the Charlotte Hornets tonight. I mean, Gordon Hayward back at Vivint Arena, where he played seven seasons along with the Jazz. He's playing well with the Hornets, knocks down the three. He scored 21 points. LaMelo Ball also played well for the Hornets with 21 points, but Rudy Gobert got the best of them on this play, the rejection. Rudy denies the rookie. Gobert with six blocks. The Jazz shot the ball well. Mike Conley corner three, up and good. He finished with 15 points. Then it's kicked out to Royce O'Neal. He's also shooting the ball well. Drains the three. Now check this out. Donovan Mitchell may have traveled on this play. Looked like a James Harden type step back. The Jazz will take it though. He scored 23 points. How about the behind the back pass from Gobert to Jordan Clarkson? And Clarkson takes it inside for two. The Jazz will trail by three at the half. More Jazz shooting in the third. Out to Joe Ingles. Money from long range. Joe made seven threes, finished with 21 points. Then Eagles fires to George Niang in the corner. Knocks it down. The Jazz led it by one after three after trailing by 11. Jazz then go inside in the fourth. Clarkson to Rudy Gobert. Throws it down. He had a double-double, 10 points, 12 rebounds. The story, though, was three-point shooting by the Jazz. They made a franchise record 28 threes while shooting 50% from threes. Clarkson with 20 points. Niang was perfect seven for seven from long range. He finished with 21 points. The Jazz won at 132-110. They're 25 and six after winning 21 of their last 23 games.